welcome to smallstoplus.in and speedearning.in today i am giving you a different set of trading principles our commodity market m6 market generally opens at 10 o'clock in morning and it ends at 11:30 in the night evening so what is the process to enter in the market which are the timings when we should be present on the screen when there are good moves so you can be there when market opens suppose at 10 o'clock market opens you should be available on the screen from 9:40 go to the all global markets you can see money control dot com money control m o n e y c o n t r o l dot com that is a site where you can have the idea about the global markets so you can see how is gold going globally how is silver how is copper how is nickel and how is crude so we are having a outline from there now suppose market opens 300 by uh, suppose in uh, case of mcx it is opening 25 30 points up comdex market means i am talking about the index commodity index comdex c o m d e x you can see comdex on right upper corner of the screen so here on right upper corner of the screen you can see the comdex so if market has opened gap up then don't go into the buying at once there may be selling and the scripts will go down then if there is buying sustaining then the scripts will come up again after some time so you just see where the market is heading it is going up or going down then prepare your market watch so your market watch should be like gold if you are trading in gold big gold or mini suppose you are trading in mini only then gold mini this month gold mini next month copper mini this month copper mini next series zinc mini this month zinc mini next series lead mini this month lead mini next series so you can keep gold mini silver mini together copper and nickel together lead and zinc together and then crude and natural gas whenever any scrape is showing buying then it will be in blue color so if screen is more in blue and less in red red then the market in hands of uh bulls and when you are uh, seeing the market more in red and less in blue then market may be in the hands of bears the market is going down market may go down from there so when you are entering into the market don't panic at any condition I don't think that you will miss any chance first of all open your market watch then see the commodity index see the percentage change percentage change column and then your first job is to see buyers and sellers systematically you can see all the buyers and sellers gold mini buyers and sellers silver mini buyers and sellers copper mini buyers and sellers nickel mini buyers and sellers then see which price is fairly above atp which price is fairly below average trading price so we can choose one commodity that is strongest we can choose 
one commodity that is bequest. Now there are some time slots which we are giving you in the training. I am talking about some very new time slots. So in the morning from, from 10.50 am to 11.10 am, I am repeating from 10.50 am to 11.10 there is a sudden movement. It's not necessarily up move or downside move. You will have to see the trend of the market. Suppose today on 27th August, market opened gap up and everything is bullish because dollar is making new highs today. So today we sent call to buy gold mini with 30 or 50 point stop loss and it just moved up 50 to 100 points. So that's a good slot to trade. Next slot may be at 230, then 430 and in evening it is 550 pm to 610. 550 to 610, 625 to 630, 635, 625 to 635 and then 653 to 710 pm. So these are some very good time slots and you should practice on this particular time slots because there is a limitation for a tipper to send the calls. We can't send you 20 calls a day. So you learn all the things, all the tricks and you can go for one or two trades independently. That will give you double benefit. You will get the sudden profit which are coming in daytime. And the next thing is you will have the confidence on your own. So after this tipping period you will be able to trade without any problem and that is the most important benefit from us. So you just see which is the strongest commodity and which is the biggest commodity. Now you can place the order on market price or price below the market price it means uh, limit order. There are two type of orders in uh, your Odin trading software market order or limit order. Suppose silver is running 55,300, so you can keep the buying order as 55,100 and the stop loss is 54,900. If market comes there, then you will get the silver in a reasonable price and whenever it is going up, you are just booking the profit. That is the defensive trading and one is aggressive trading. Aggressive trading means you are just buying the thing at the price available, suppose it is running 55,200, you are placing the order. If it is not coming in 200, it is uh, it has gone to 260. So you are uh, uh, keeping putting the price up 270, and you are buying it right now, and then you are keeping the stop loss. In that case, you will have to keep big stop loss, and chances are more to hit the sell if you are going aggressive. 